Russian Foreign Minister Sergei Lavrov has come under fire for his comments on Adolf Hitler involving Jews. But did Hitler really have Jewish blood on his body? I will explain about this in today's video. Lavrov's remarks, which sparked Russia's diplomatic row with Israel, actually sparked a rumor about the identity of Hitler's grandfather in 1920. Hitler's father, Alois, was an illegitimate child, Austrian historian Roman Sandgruber told AFP. Alois did not have a paternal identity. Last year, Sandgruber published a biography of Alois Hitler. He explained that as soon as Adolf Hitler began to rise to power in 1920, the rumors spread. This theory was propagated by his political rivals after Nazi leader Hitler took power in Germany in 1933. The memoirs of Hans Frank, a Nazi war criminal who ruled Poland during World War II after World War II, reignited Jewish doctrine in Hitler. In the memoir published after Hans Frank's execution for war crimes in 1948, Frank mentioned that he had secretly researched his lineage at Hitler's request. According to a report published in the German magazine Der Spiegel at the time, the study was conducted in the late 1930s, Frank wrote in his memoirs. Hitler told Frank that his nephew was blackmailing him about it. What was the evidence of Hitler's Jewish affiliation? Alois was born in 1836 to Hitler's grandmother, Maria Anna Schickelgruber. At the time, Maria was working as a cook for a Jewish family named Frankenberger in the Austrian town of Graz, according to Frank's research. Frank writes in his memoirs that Maria's employer paid for Alois' care until Alois reached the age of 14. Frank's claim is that the exchange of letters between Maria and the employer's family proved the point. Frank said Hitler told him that he actually let the Jewish man think he was the father in order to get money from his grandmother and her future husband. But historians are skeptical. However, Sandgruber said there was no hard evidence to support Frank's claim. He argued that the Jews did not have the right to live in the garage at the time. So the question is who was Hitler's grandfather? This is an unanswered question, the historic offer Adre told Israel's Haaretz newspaper on Monday. I hope you enjoy our video. If you enjoy our video, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe and share.